And another thing about storage, um, I had a discussion on uh, Google Plus a bit about. Uh, I fantasize about uh, the next uh, iPhone will uh, support both USB 3.0 and Thunderbolt in uh, the new small dock connector and uh, also support uh, storage, file storage on the phone as a USB flash drive. That would be really awesomely cool. Uh, that means that if I buy a 64 gigabyte iPhone next time, I could use uh, all that space that I don't use as an um, extension to my MacBook Air 11 inch SSD drive. Uh, and it will be uh, almost as fast or as fast as my SSD drive. So that would be awesome because I always have my iPhone with me only connect it with a new dock connector cable and I have extra storage from my iPhone. Really cool. But of course that's only my dream, my fantasy. But if Apple could do that, uh, add support for USB 3.0 or Thunderbolt uh, on the iPhone, the next iPhone, then we can use it as external storage extension for our Max. Really cool. So that uh, will probably never happen, I don't think so, but I think that the new iPhone will support USB 3.0. That I'm sure about, but use a phone as a storage, it, it doesn't seem that Apple does want us to to do that for some reason. It would be really cool to, for example, this video that I record now, um, just plug in the iPhone and use it in Final Cut Pro directly from my phone instead of have to transfer it to my MacBook Air, if you know what I mean. That would be really cool. Think about it. Just plug the cable into your MacBook Air and use the file directly from the iPhone after I have recorded it. It's really great. The same thing with our photos and so on. Just use it directly. I think that's amazing, but apparently Apple doesn't think that. And I don't know why, what can happen. I mean, um, if I record this in 720p instead of 1080p, I usually do that with my car vlogs. Uh, then uh, around 10 minutes uh, is around 1 gigabyte in size and it takes some time to transfer that to my MacBook Air. If I only could plug the cable in and use the file directly where it is stored on my iPhone in Final Cut Pro without transfer it, I mean, I would save a lot of time doing that. And my time is precious because I, job I work all day my work and I, when I come home uh, I will eat some dinner with my wife and uh, meanwhile eating dinner I transfer the file to my MacBook Air and, and when I'm finished eating then it's ready to start edit it and um, I could have a lot more time start editing it and so on and directly instead of waiting for all that transfer time, I will save a lot of my precious time. It's too bad that Apple doesn't do these kind of things. It would be, it would make their devices even better. I mean, an iPhone that support uh, USB 3.0 that you can use as expansion to your MacBook storage, I mean the SSD, yeah? it will be really really great, but as I said, probably not, it will not happen, I'm sure of that, too bad. <laughs>